have these coupons for like $15, so it's like we can't let that go to waste. All right, Victoria's Secret, check. We must vlog everything. That's I the see that. Of okay, now this is the only thing in school they have for school supplies. And that's the end of the vlog I have for today. And since this vlog is significantly shorter than many of my past vlogs have been, I think it was only like a minute long, I thought that rather than combining days, I would make an announcement in this video. And this was actually the day that I did decide to become vegan. Well, almost. We'll get to that in a second. But basically, the vlog before this, we were at a lake and we were there because we went to go visit some friends that we had that used to live in California right next to us. They lived actually in the street that's like right next to this one. And then they moved away. They moved back to Minnesota. So every time we go back there, we could go and visit them. And they have a really nice house and it's right on a lake. So we always go and visit them and they let us stay in their house and they're like really, really sweet. And there are cars passing by because I'm like outside. So sorry if you can hear like the traffic out there. But anyway, they are actually vegan and they were just telling us they weren't forcing it they were just like oh this is what we do and they are actually really kind like they were well they were vegetarian last year well she was I'm not sure if her son or her husband were but she was vegetarian last year but she always made something for us if we like weren't vegetarian like she never like forced us to be like vegetarian or vegan or anything she and her daughter Naomi who's also very very sweet um were vegan Naomi had actually been vegan for about like four years now and um Allison the person's house you're staying at she has been like starting to be vegan and she's like it was making her feel like so much better and like she was just like losing weight like healthily you know and she just really liked being vegan and then she recommended some videos on Netflix um like what the health and then I think the other one was Cowspiracy which I haven't watched but we actually ended up watching what the health just because we wanted to learn more about it and I had heard a lot about being vegan from like other youtubers and the street is really busy right now <laughs> just like a lot of cars going by but anyway I had heard about being vegan from lots of other youtubers you know like um, Tana Mojo is one of them I remember she was talking about how much it was like helping her skin and I actually have acne still so I was really like interested in trying it I just never like went for it and since we were on the topic we were talking about it we were out the lake uh, we just decided to watch the what the health movie and it was very eye-opening for me and I just want to be healthier as a person and there are a couple things that I don't necessarily agree with about being vegan obviously using like non-animal treated like cruelty free products basically I definitely want to take advantage of that I don't eat meat anymore I don't drink straight up milk I don't eat eggs but there are some things I still have cheese sometimes on like some things and then I'll have dressings you know like on salad I'll have like a ranch dressing or a blue cheese dressing which obviously has like milk or cheese in it obviously it's not like a significant amount and also I'll sometimes have like desserts that are obviously made with like milk and cookies so obviously I'm like still in the transition phase once I start like cooking my own meals I'll be able to like make my own desserts that are obviously like completely vegan and like right now I'm like still tra transitioning sorry about that I'm still transitioning into being vegan but I don't eat meat anymore I don't drink milk and I don't eat eggs ever and I have it for about two weeks now so I basically just started it it's not like something that's like super significant no not super significant um, it's still pretty significant because I have been doing it for like two whole wait 
I think it's been three weeks. I have been doing this for three weeks. And again, not completely vegan. Not completely. Um, I also gave up yogurt. I didn't really yike, like, yike, wow. I didn't really like yogurt before, but I would eat it sometimes because I'd always think that it was like filling. So in the morning I'd have some yogurt just so that make sure I had like breakfast in the morning. But anyway, gave that up too because that actually wasn't one of my favorites. So that was easy to give up. Obviously some things are harder than others. Cheese is gonna be really hard for me to give up because I love like pizza and I love like cheese on my pizza. And from now on I do go to like Blaze or like Pyology or something like that, which can make you you, what? Can, you can make your own pizza, sorry. I was losing my train of thought. You can make your own pizza and you can get it without cheese and without like meats or anything. So I usually have like a vegetable pizza without cheese. And I don't like vegan cheese, so I don't ever like go with that. I just go with like no cheese most of the time. <laughs> most of the time I'm still transitioning into like no cheese like ever and like making like my own desserts and that stuff I don't have like super often. I don't have it like every day, but there have been times that I did. Oh, and I also had clam chowder from Bubba Gump, which was amazing. That is going to be extremely hard to give up. And I don't know if I will. And see, that's the thing. It's like all those like limitations. Like obviously it's not gonna be something I have every single day, but if there's like one night a year like I don't know like my birthday or something like special and I want to have like a bowl of clam chowder from Bubba Gun. like I might um things like meat though I don't think I'll ever eat again I don't ever need that um not that I didn't like it but I didn't love it like that was pretty easy for me to give up anyway I think that's it for my updates um I don't mean to be judgmental on anyone, obviously. I'm a strong believer in choices. I believe that you should choose what's best for you. This is something that I wanted to try and I've been noticing differences. You know, I've been feeling better and I've been um, not as like full feeling and I really like that. I think I've been like losing some weight. Like my belly punch has like decreased, which I'm so happy about and it's just had so many like factors like that you know it's just it's made me feel better and it's made me feel more energetic and I don't feel as full or as unhealthy and that would happen a lot when back when I was eating like meat and like milk and stuff like that so I am very happy to be vegan now and if you guys are going vegan or you're vegan you should definitely leave it in a comment down below but I think that's it for this video and I'll see you guys on my next one bye guys